Mate, I've legit just seen that curtain moving. There's definitely someone in there. They look, look like they looked out of the curtain. And we have to go in there? Yeah. 100% mate, they just looked out of that curtain. I don't want to go in there, but I suppose we'll have to, won't we? <laughs> mate, there's definitely someone in there. Ow! No, we're not this street, are we? No, not at all, mate. you're waiting for me. <laughs> Come on, lad. Come in, I'm coming. You're through. Ready for this? Yep, let's do it. Let's go. Back door open. Hello? Do you ever hear strange bumps in the night or swear blind somebody is watching you from a corner of a room? Well tonight we head inside this abandoned home where these strange occurrences have been witnessed. The house has sat abandoned since the late 90s when the owner Russell suddenly passed away leaving all his worldly possessions inside. Ever since passers-by have seen strange events take place such as shadowy figures leering from the windows, music coming from the house which hasn't had electric for many years and cries echoing out from the property late at night. After hearing about this house and the strange occurrences we head to the north of England to check it out. So join us as we take a look inside and see what and who remain. Look, everything's just left. Completely perfect. It does look like the bit of vandal damage though. Yeah, a little bit. Doesn't it? Well, I think so, unless it's like decay. Oh no, that's, yeah. Got right. clothes still hanging on the radiator. <laughs> and what the hell are these? Bottles of piss. It does look like bottles of piss indeed. But who's saving that much piss? You're pissing that much piss. Bear girls won't drink <laughs> that much piss, mate. Ivy growing through the door here, look. I know. Should we get in the house? Yeah, mate, you first. Oh, he's still got his shoes there, look. Shit, off, mate. <laughs> wow. Dining room table still set up. Calendar. February 1997. Trophy here, check that out. But like we were saying, Jack is still hung up. Should I give it the big hello? Hey, hello? Hello? Is anyone in this house? I think I heard footsteps. Yeah, the car stopped us on it. Has it? Yeah. All the glasses still left. Cupboards are just full. Man, this is vibes. Off the chart. It's just completely frozen in time. Like a whole family's life just left. Washing up still on the side. Hello? Is anyone here? Map 
of Ireland. Bathroom. Check out some of these rooms. Hopefully nobody's here. Wow. Oh Matt, there's blood. Blood? There's blood specks on this all over this. No way. Is it blood? Yeah. Oh yeah. Man, I'm getting such a horrible vibe in here. I am. This bed still looks slapped in. Look at the dent in the middle. See? As if somebody's still sleeping there. Yeah. All broken glass. Someone's running, man. I heard that. Shout. Hello? Is there someone there? <laughs> man, I'm not enjoying that. Mate, this is messed up, this house. Look at the dead plants. Newspaper clippings, bits of clothes still hanging. That blood's freaking me out though. Mate, the whole place is freaking out. Got the mould around the door. <laughs> right, I'm not going to touch that quill. Step over that. Yeah. yeah. I swear there's someone out, like honestly. Hello? Is there anyone sleeping here? We're just exploring, we're not police or anything. That's alright, anyway. Alcohol stash. Beautiful furniture, isn't it? Yeah. Trinket cupboard. Nice. Where's this newspaper from? 94. Even Mickey Mouse needs a bodyguard. We need a bodyguard now. <laughs> Cassettes. Now check out this old photograph. <laughs> Mate, like I've not even started. You? What? I've not even started recording me because I'm like genuinely shitting myself. It sounded like Velcro ripping. Yeah, that was it could have been you. Yeah. yeah. It's got such a bad feeling. Yeah. Not in a horror way. I know you did actually say on the way. Yeah, out. like it's just got such like a shit feeling in it. So when we were driving up tonight, Matt was saying he's got a bad feeling about tonight. Feels like something's gonna go wrong. As we pulled up, I swear to God, I seen those curtains twitching <clears throat> as if someone was peeping out. And we've already heard like footsteps, a few bangs already. We've been in the house, what, 10 minutes? <sighs> and the place is vibes. Like what? Well, hopefully it's not a weapon that somebody's sleeping here using. <laughs> So all the blood is in there. Oh, I don't, mate. Imagine. An Irish blessing. 
May the road rise to meet you. May the wind always at your back, Mr. Wordell. May the sun shine warm on your face. May the rains fall soft in the fields. And until we meet again, may God hold you in the palm of his hand. Always good to say a prayer. I'll check out this. Little um, telescope. Even the ceiling roses fell away. Someone's had this carpet off as well. So like a little tail. Look at this, trinket cupboard. I have no idea, mate. It's not like three knocks. Tail. Look at this, trinket cupboard. Tail. Look at this, trinket cupboard. Hopefully the camera picked that up. Little frog. It's crazy how this is abandoned. I know, it's got such like nice furniture in it. I know, the size of that cognac bottle. Hmm. Is that a ukulele? It is. Wow, look how old this mobile is. <laughs> That's got to be 80s. Do you know what it reminds me of? What? It's like the one that's um, on Jurassic Park and it's ringing inside that massive pile of turd. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely an Irish fella. Look how the photos have all melted though. Isn't that weird? Old Panasonic stereo. Vinyls. This is a bit out of place, eh? What? Medieval furniture. Oh yeah. It looks like it should be in like a castle or something. Yeah. Books mould all around the windows, man. So, that's the downstairs. We're just gonna check the upstairs where we heard the noises from. So that's uh, something to look forward to. If there is somebody in here, they're obviously keeping quiet and hiding. Yeah, and they'll be upstairs when they, cause I'm not down there. Definitely. Oh, isn't it? It's quite narrow though, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, it stinks. Oh, that's heavy. Do you want me up there? You alright? I'm alright. You sound there? Yeah. Big balls of me. <laughs> Little gay porn. <laughs> There's actually like bugs crawling over it as well. Computer, that needs uh, checking. One flew over the cuckoo's nest. Clothes still hung. All suits. Looks like an older man. Oh, that's creepy. I can't get around the door, but an eye just watching me. Old house phone. Check out that alarm clock. Wow. I can't believe all this is left. Socks. It's me, mate. It's me. It's you. Yeah, it's my shoe. Don't ever do that again. Sorry. Oh, mate, lube. Oh, lovely. Petroleum jelly. Did I hear something about gay porn earlier, but? Yeah, thought you'd pick that up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it definitely stinks up here, though. Candles in the bathroom. If it wasn't for the vibes, and oh my god, this room is massive. There's a knife on the bed. There's a whole ass knife on the bed. Looks like somebody's been sleeping here. All trinkets in that bottom cupboard. Dare I open anything? Oh, it's empty, it's all right. Stacks of magazines. That's gonna need blurring. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Twelve pornos. But we're talking Oriental Dreams, um, Gym Buddies, Soviet Slut Boys, and Russian Anal. Old typewriter though, we can film that, that's safe. Hoover. House explored, and it doesn't seem like anyone's here unless they are hiding in a very good hiding place. Oh, wipes. Um, so yeah, we're just going to set up some paranormal equipment now and see if anything is in this house. Okay, Explorers, so we're just going to walk around with the K2 and the Spirit Talker going and then we're going to set up in one of the rooms 
possibly that's most active. It is pitch black in this place. Hopefully that'll bring something out. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so if there's any spirits in this house, any people that want to communicate with us, you can do through the device that I'm holding. It will change colours, it will go from green to amber to red. Or you can speak to the device that Matt's holding if you have any words or messages you want to pass on. So can you tell us, did anyone pass away in this house? Speak to the device. The witch is here. The witch is here. Mate. <sighs> Thought I saw something then, but it's the mirror. If anyone would like to touch this green device, it'll change colours as I said. It'll just let us know that you're here, it won't harm you in any way whatsoever. Mate, I'm so on edge, man. I am. I've already heard footsteps and knocks, bangs. Mate, the first thing we get, the witch is here. Yeah. That is quite <laughs> peculiar. <laughs> and this house is freaky as it is. Blood stains, strange smells. If it wasn't in the dark, and walk around, that's why. I keep losing right. focus, what? The children play games. Mate, don't, because I can't see. Did you hear that though? Yeah. The children play games and then just like multiple taps. <sighs> Mate. Is there anyone in this house? Can you make another knock? Mate, I swear to God, I've just seen something, mate. What? I don't know, because I couldn't see. But there's light coming to that window. I'm like, I swear, mate, it's something like past that door. On the left. Be cool, man. If anyone's up there, take it easy. <laughs> but leave him. Are you okay? Mate. You've just told him to be okay. And he's saying, are you okay? Yeah, we're good. Yeah, I'm fine now. I think. <laughs> Mate, that's crazy. Are you okay? Literally, as you said, like, be okay. Yeah, I had that. Whoever's in this house with us, touch this device on the piano. Mate, I had that, yeah. She screams. Oh my she god. She screams. She screams. The witch. We literally just heard that tap and then it said she screams. Slow as well the last few nights, hasn't it? Yeah, has, yeah. And tonight just non-stop. Can you make another knock? It just did another knock, did not hear it. It's not like a whole cabinet shifted. Touch that device on the piano, let us know where you are. I've never been so scared, honestly. And how many places have we actually done? Hundreds. So we are getting multiple noises, quite consistent as well. The device is coming up with some pretty mad answers. Can you make one more knock for us? Mate, that was bang yeah, on. Yeah, literally as you asked me. Can you make one more knock for us? Nana. 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 Mate. Did you hear it though? It's not like someone was walking towards me. I've never moved so quick. Hello? In light, there is darkness. In light, there is darkness. You, I'm using infrared light. You hear that? Yeah. Whoever's making those knocks, do you want to come towards us? Touch this device. Bloodstained sheets in this room. Jeez. You look the same. The beards, bro. The bed there. Is that what you're talking about? Can 
can you touch this device on the bed let us know that you're here obviously we've heard several knocks footsteps can you do that again for us you're looking pretty panicky there, Matt. Yeah, I am. I'm proper on edge, Matt. Never looked like this before. It is a very weird vibe in this house. Does not feel like we're alone from the first second we pulled up. You with me on that? Me? Yeah. Yeah, 100% me. I think I want to come in here. This bedroom is a bit out of place, you know, thinking about it. No. Come Infernal One. Come Infernal... Come Infernal One. Infernal one, what does that mean? That's what I mean, I don't know. Yeah, we're getting stuff made that we've never had before. Might join. Not tonight. If anyone's here, do you want to touch this K2 device? Just want to pop that down. Can you make another noise that we'll be able to hear? Oh, by the way, killing, killing, the blood. And there's a there's a knife upstairs on the bed. There's a knife upstairs on the bed. Can you tell us what the knife's for? Is it for protection and defence or? Killing, like you've just said. Relation. Relation. Relation as in defence. And that's the killing. Somebody killed here in self-defence. Maybe. That's the whole reason this house is abandoned. Maybe. And we're just in here. We're just in here. Spirits walk. Spirits walk. Spirits walk. We've heard loads of footsteps. Yeah, we have heard quite a few footsteps tonight. I know, be careful, man. I need to turn this around, I can't see anything. You're gonna come upstairs with me? You're gonna have to, yeah. I need to know what that K2 uh, spirit group yeah. is saying. What? Knock. 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 Knock in my lips, mate. Oh, the smell of beer, man. Oh, what was that? What was what? Hello? Oh, the smell of beer, man. Oh, what was that? What was what? What was what? It looked like something walked past the banister. Not so. Oh, you did as well. Someone literally walked this way, mate. Is there someone up here with us? What was that? Yeah, upstairs. Oh, it does stink a bit. So, Jesus. Jesus. Head down to that bedroom, that where we just seen something. Down there? Yeah. Man, I hate it. There was definitely no one in there. Yeah. What's all that on the quilt? What? Where your leg is now. Shit, is that blood? Is that dry blood? Looks it. Oh, I can't make it out on the quilt. Oh, it stinks a bit, mate. It looks like dry blood. And look at this. George. George. Literally a knife. George. It does look like dry blood, Matt. Mate, it stinks up here, mate. You can see it here. Oh, mate, what is that smell? Mate. A woman here. What's that banging? Oh, the fucking blood quilt. Oh, Jesus. You can see it. 
Yeah, it's literally blood, mate. Oh, it fucking stinks. Let's go down, bro. Don't leave me in the dark, but I can't see shit. No. <laughs> I need to... Mate, that's crazy. I'm going to have to put a light on, mate, honestly. Mate, I love how quick you went down, him. I'll put a light on. Oh, my God. <laughs> what? It's like a cobweb, but they say that's what it feels like when someone touches you, don't they? Mate, that's disgusting. The smell up there. Yeah. It's not like someone coming down the stairs. It did. The smell up there. Yeah. Someone just followed us down. <laughs> Mate, I'm so I'm shitting myself, honestly. That was strange. It literally sounded like somebody walked in and came down the stairs, didn't it? I'm thinking we shouldn't really set up tonight because it takes so long hmm. and it's gonna it's a bit of a dodgy house. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to stay in it too long. I'm not thinking that, I'm just thinking if we need to run, yeah, yeah, yeah. we can't have cameras everywhere. No. Just do it on the handhelds. Yeah, so we can get out very quick. Yeah. Okay, explorers, so a little bit different. We're not gonna set up with the other cameras tonight. We're just gonna use the one night vision camera. We do have equipment around the room. We have K2 cat balls on the sofa. We have music box facing the front door, REM pod. We are going to use the necrometer again as we got such good results with it last week. I might get it on there as well. And K2 there and Catball. So guys, we are just going to start off with shouting out and see what responses we get. We have heard a lot of knocks and bangs already in the house. Um, crazy place. Yeah, I am so on You ready? Fuck yeah. it over, lad. Let's just get it right. going. So if there's anyone in this house with us, you can set one of these devices off, balls, lights that change colour we have music box by the front door that will set off a tune if you pass it you can also touch that red light on your cabinet there so if there is anyone here come and speak to us let us know that you're here with us we don't mean any disrespect being here my name's adam i'm not and we just want to we just want to communicate Nothing more. So is there anyone in this house with us? Jesus. What's in that? Income. Income. Can you explain what you mean by that? You're obviously very wealthy. There's a lot of antiques. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What's that? There's something dark There's here. There's something dark here. Well, we already know that. We can feel it. Can you tell us what dark thing is here? Is the dark thing a person or entity that lives in this house? Russell. Mate, it makes me jump every time, Russell. Russell. Is that your name or is that the name of the spirit here? There's some letters by the front door if you want to check them. Just in case. Oh, you forget that was there? Yeah. <laughs> so that will just let us know if anyone's by the bottom of the stairs or the front door. Can you tell us who Russell or the dark spirit or entity is? Anything? Mate. What? Like, it doesn't say an actual name, but it's Mr. R. Mitchell. No way. Swear to God, mate. I'm moving. Mr. R. Mitchell. No way. Wonder if it's a Russell. Possibly. Mate. Can't touch them? Yeah. 
I, that's, I, when I was by the front door, it felt like cobwebs. What the fuck? I've never had anything like that. It felt like my hoodie was getting pulled up. Imagine if it is, and it's on camera, mate. <sighs> is that what it felt like? Yeah, it felt like this was like getting lifted up a bit. Oh, Jesus. I mean, he was fond of the fellas. Yeah, he was. Uh, <laughs> Good old wrestle. Is that you that's just touched Matt? He's trying to wrestle me up, mate. That's what he's doing. Can you tell us what the dark thing is? You said there's something dark here. Is that a person? Certain. Certain. You said there's something dark here. Certain. Mate, this is crazy. <laughs> Mate, I don't know why I was literally ready to run them. <laughs> <laughs> Did something... Rope. Rope. Mate, what the hell was that? What did it sound like? It's not like a door was opening. Hopefully, the, I missed it. Hopefully, the camera got it. Did something bad happen here? Can you tell us what the blood stains are on the sheets? I said, is there something bad here? And it said, certain. I'd like to know more about what you said darks here. Can you tell us? Can what if it's a dark entity or or spirit demon, whatever you want to be called? Can you set one of these devices off? They won't harm you. They are just used for communication. Let us know where you are. Let us know if you want to talk to us. Can you do that for us? Just touch one of these devices. Show them how, Matt. Sometimes they like to be shown, don't they? It'll tell us that you're here with us. And this one here as well. Just walk in front of it. It'll play a song for you. You're welcome to play with them. They're not going to harm you. Mate, that's so weird that you felt touched. And I felt like... Honestly, it, it felt like my hoodie was like getting pulled up. Like, legit. And I've never had anything like that before. Was that you? Don't move. Is there somebody on the stairs right now? Do you want to come down, come into this room with us? Mate, I legit just heard something on the stairs or the hallway. But it looked like a shadow went like up, up this wall and just disappeared. Were you the shadow? Sorry. Dust. Can you tell us what the dark entity is? Wrong. <gasps> Can you touch this red device that I've placed? Interaction. Interaction. As you're asking, can you touch it? Can you interact with any of the lights or devices around the room for me, please? As I said, they won't harm you in any way whatsoever. If it's Russell, can you do that for me now? Yeah. Yeah. Is that a room above there? Yeah, the bedroom. It's not like someone was walking there. Hmm. Can you uh, do this, Russell? Can you do that? Can you walk through this doorway? You're welcome to come in here. Wait and see, I'm sure your K2 was going off then when I turn around. Mate, there's something about this place, 100%. Yeah. Uh, Russell, were you a Catholic? <laughs> dance. I ain't dancing, you can no, dance. Sorry, we're not, not very good at dancing. 
obviously you were very religious you got the pr prayers on the walls were you a catholic did you go against your religion with what you found attractive was that seen as a sin is that why it's hidden correct oh mate <laughs> no way correct no way how mad's that correct mate as you literally asked it a question is that what you mean by something dark here? Is it like a feeling? Maybe guilt? Or what would be another? No, oh, it's just the... Shame? Yeah. The dark is the sin. That's the feeling he's getting, maybe. Obviously, it wouldn't... But to him, it would have been being... Yeah, that's what I mean. From yeah, a Catholic yeah. Irish family. Yeah. Maybe that's why he's still in the house, maybe. Is that right? Am I along the same, on the right lines? Do you feel guilt or shame for what you were into? I'm just thinking with it being Catholic, Irish. Mm. It does feel like a woman lived here as well. There's a few feminine bits. So maybe he had a wife and he, it was secret. You reckon? I think so, mate. There's also blood everywhere and a knife. So God knows. It said killing relation. Did something happen? With your family here? Make me. Make an answer. Yeah, maybe I'm stuck sweating on Steam But I just want to say, Russell, that you don't have to be ashamed or guilty or anything along those lines. If that's what you feel is keeping you here. Wait and see again. again. One thing though, you never get repeat answers. No. Never ever yeah, get repeat answers. Like, what are we waiting to see? Have you got something you want to show us? Well, he pulled your top. Mate, I'm convinced. Can like, you do that again? But to Adam instead? I don't want it again. I feel like we've got some really good answers there. Do you I know what I want to do? I want to take some Polaroids. Yeah, yeah, I reckon we should, mate. And then maybe do... You... I had a good life. I had a good life. We're glad to hear that. Yeah, see if we can capture anything on camera. Yeah. And then do a spirit box. See if we can get any more answers out of him. Yeah. We are going to get the Polaroid out, have a walk round, snap some of the rooms, and see if we can pick up anything. Keep the devices going while we do it. Yeah, can do it. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. sit here that came through mm. okay guys so we're just gonna have a walk through take some polaroids of kitchen a couple of the rooms see if we pick anything up be good to try and get as much of the room as possible though, wouldn't yeah it? we'll do i'm literally in pitch black well, i feel like this um there's a strange smell in this room you know just keep that going in. just keep this uh Necrometer going as well, eh? Right, can you, uh, definitely feel like we need to get this room? Oh, yeah, definitely, yeah. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> how, are you, how are you doing it from which, um. I'll have to do it from here, won't I? Try and get yeah. as much as the bed as possible. I feel like there's something with this bed, you know. <laughs> we just get like two more rooms, maybe. Yeah. What was that? Eric. Eric. Do you know it wouldn't surprise me if we did get a few men's names through? Because maybe he was having really, affairs yeah, or something. Yeah. That doesn't make a lot of sense actually. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Do you know what I'm feeling? That chair, that armchair. Yeah. That's what I was drawn to pretty much straight away. Hopefully we get some stuff on. I think I've got a feeling about it now. Yeah. With the way it's been going so far. Hello. <laughs> Try and get as much of the room as possible. I say go up the stairs, mate, because I see that thing, didn't I? Do it from where you stood now, up the stairs. From here? Yeah. But it's creeping up when the flash goes off. Yeah. Right, so we need to wait for these to develop. Yeah. That's me. Okay. On this table. 
table. No. I can't believe you felt touched. Mate, I'm hoping your camera's picked it up. Well, I was facing you. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, it, it definitely felt like my hoodie went up. Like, I don't know how else to explain it. Strange, eh? It was, mate. Right, so we'll just wait for them to develop. Yeah. Let's see what happens there. Hey guys, so Polaroids have developed. There's the bedroom. To me, Matt, mm -hmm. that bed looks sunken in in the middle. Yeah, I thought that when I had a look in it earlier. Do you think? Yeah. Definitely does. Room with the piano there. And that's the that's the bedroom with the blood, isn't it? On the, it the is, yeah. I wonder if someone died in there. Maybe. But that room there with the piano, I get vibes in there. Yeah. 100% kitchen. Top of the stairs. Seems like there's something at the top of the stairs there, Matt. Where about? Right at the top, like sat on the top stairs. What, where I seen the, the yeah. thing walk across? Yeah, check that out. Look That's at that. It. Oh, yeah. I'll have to get a close up of it. There, like a shadow, like something sat there. <coughs> Jesus, two. Two. Is there two shadows? I'm not sure. But look at that, definitely looks like something sat. Yeah. Like a head in the middle and arms. I see. Can you see it? Yeah. Where's the Polaroid? I'll go and take another one. I'll go and take another one. Just stand at the bottom of the stairs. Yeah, it was direct at the bottom, wasn't it? Here. Yeah, straight up. Consort. To me, that does look like something at the top of the stairs there. Right, that's done. I'll just have to wait for it to develop. Yeah. Okay, guys, so, shadow on the top of the stairs there. This is the picture oh, I can't that's pick just bloody nails. <laughs> Mate. It's not that, mate. Mate, there's nothing there. It's not that. Words. Side by side. Mate, it's not there. So on the left one, you can see something at the top of the stairs. And on the right, nothing at all. Bro, that's strange. Guys, look at that. There's like a black mess on this one here. Just there. And there's absolutely nothing on the one that I just took. As you can see, there's nothing there that would cause that mist. Just on the top stack there. It's like a black mist. Let me see it. Hopefully you can see it. Between the door frame and the cabinet. Okay, explorers, so that is strange. That is very weird. Black mist. Matt's just took an identical photo from the same spot and there is nothing there at all. What is happening? How do you even explain that? It's exactly the same. It's the same well, photo. I tried my best to get it from the same spot. It pretty much is, isn't it? This is the same photo twice, look. One's got a black mist, the other hasn't. I feel like we just do a, a spirit box. I'm thinking in that back room with the piano and just see yeah. if we can get any messages coming through. Okay guys, so Necrophonics sat up on the piano. I keep getting weird vibes from this room and this chair behind me. Yeah. So I feel like we should just have one little session in here just to check. Yeah. You ready for this? So if there is a rustle in this house, can you come forward and speak to us? Yeah. Sure. Was that here or sure? As we discussed, you obviously feel like you lived in sin in this house. Can you tell us if that's true? Some. Liar. Liar, yeah. I wonder if that's his wife. A woman's voice saying liar. K2. Mm -hmm. That's great. Can you tell us what the dark the darkness in this house was? Mad house. Can you tell us what the darkness was that you referred to? Is there somebody on the stairs or upstairs that would like to come down and speak to us? Just shook. happened then. The whole fucking piano just shook. 
Bro, the whole, the yeah, whole piano is just shook. The whole thing moved, man. Can you tell us who caused the piano to move? Mate, the band. There was a full on knock on, wasn't there? Man, I'm so an like. Shh, just listen. And again. Yeah. What was happening there? There was full on walking. Yeah. And I had like a, like someone was shaking. Whoever's uh, interfering or interacting with this house, can you tell us your name? Mate. Is there something bad in this house? Bob. Get out. Can you make another knock or bang or footsteps for us? Can you make a loud knock for us, just to prove that to you? Make something obvious and clear. Energy. Can you do that noise for us again? Walking. You're sweating like mad. Mate, I'm sweating from places I didn't even know I could sweat. Cause I'm not like on edge, it's ridiculous mate. I didn't want to come in here tonight. Cause I knew something was gonna happen mate. Guys, there's something in this house. And I don't know what it is. I have such a bad feeling about this place. Mate. Well, this is on a way out, like, that was such a bad feeling. And then we stop outside, you see someone in the window. We come in here, there's sheets of blood everywhere. <laughs> there's someone in this house, 100%. Something's on the top of my back. Should we head out? Yeah, I think I it's time. I, think, I genuinely think it's best, mate, if you yeah. leave it. Let's go. Yeah.